In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to play Steam games with a PlayStation 4 controller. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. The method that I'm gonna show you in this video only requires that you run any game that you want to play through Steam. You can even add non-Steam games to your library and this will work. Usually, what you have to do is download tools like DS4 Windows, which allows you to manage the keybinds for a DualShock 4. But Steam nowadays has great controller compatibility for any model of controller, including PS4 controllers. So all that you have to do, like I mentioned, is to run any game through Steam. First, go ahead and connect your controller to your PC. I'm going to assume that you already know how to connect it, so I'm going to skip this part. You can either use a cable or connect it wirelessly through Bluetooth. With the controller properly connected and detected by your PC, whenever you click on any game under your library, you should see this little gamepad icon. To double check if you have this option, you can click the settings gear on any game that you select on your library, go into the properties and select the controller properties. This is where you can enable Steam Input. Steam Input is the tool that allows us to run any game through Steam and it is going to get automatically set up with the keybinds to use any controller, including PlayStation 4 controllers to play it. So make sure that Steam Input is enabled and you can double check by going into the controller general settings and enabling Steam Input for PlayStation controllers. While you're at this menu, you might want to consider enabling it for all types of controllers. With Steam Input properly set up and enabled for the game that you selected, all that you have to do is click this little gamepad icon before running the game and you can now browse through all the layouts made for a specific game. You will find recommended official layouts, templates or community made layouts. You will notice that I'm using an Xbox controller but the process is the same if you have a PlayStation 4 one. I'm only recording this video with an Xbox controller for demonstration purposes. You can edit the layout on your own, if you prefer you can change the d-pad, the triggers, joysticks, and as long as you have Steam input enabled with a layout, when you run the game through Steam, everything will get automatically set up for you to play, so you can go ahead with the controller connected and start playing. As long as you run any game through Steam, even games that you don't own directly through Steam, you will be able to use Steam input to play with a PlayStation 4 controller. I hope I was able to help you on how to play Steam games with a PlayStation 4 controller. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.